you know, you're known for your burgers. What is the secret to a good burger? Meat. The meat you use. Okay. Meat. Quality. Uh, we, we use the... The way the burger was born at Bymark was that I needed some way to use the tissue end of my strip loins. So I had USDA prime beef and the tissue end. I'm not going to sell anybody a steak with a tissue end. I just can't do it. If people come into my restaurant, everything has to be perfect. perfect. So we were looking for a way to use these. And then we, we, we just trimmed them down. We kept 23% fat in it. We did a medium grind and we did a burger and we ate it and we just died when we ate it. So that was the genesis of the idea for the burger for us. Now we weren't the first to do that. Like Danielle Bouillou in New York was was. I think you were the first in Canada to like up the ante on the burger, though. Yeah, they're, they're yeah. still talking about it after yeah. after eight <laughs> years, <laughs> which is hilarious. But uh, it was born out of a, a necessity to use the tissue end of this great strip loin we had. So it's all about the meat. And it's all about the ingredients. You can't fake anything. Right. You know, there's a lot of people that have done expensive burgers, but they use very poor meat. And it was all just a gimmick. Right. And that's, that's why the burger's still alive today. The quality. Quality, yeah. yeah.